Hey, what's up guys? Jeremy with Everything iDevice, and in this video, we're going to be doing, yes, another iOS 7 tutorial slash kind of coverage or walkthrough, whatever you want to call it, but uh, anyways, in this video, we're going to be taking a look at Control Center, and the way you open up Control Center is you just simply swipe from the bottom of your screen. Uh, you can access Control Center within any app from the home screen and even from the lock screen, so it's very, very convenient, and kind of seeing this coming uh, so as you can see at the top there, you do have quick toggles. You can turn on AirPlay mode with just the click of a button. You can switch back on Wi-Fi. You got Bluetooth. You got Do Not Disturb, and you have orientation lock on the right there. Also, you do have your brightness slider right there, which is a nice touch. You got your music controller, play, pause, previous, next. Uh, you know how it works. <laughs> also, it will display the song information in there as well when it's playing. You do have your airdrop button right there in the middle, which gives you a couple of options when you enable it. Uh, it'll ask you for contacts only or everyone that's around you. Um, also, you have uh, some shortcuts down here. First off is the flashlight, which is hella convenient. Thank you, Apple, finally. No more stupid flashlight app. Um, also, you do have a shortcut to your clock application, a shortcut to your calculator, and then obviously a shortcut to your camera, directly to your camera. So that alone would be very, you know, handy when you're within an application and the moment strikes where you got to take a, a quick photo, just pull up on control center, click the photo button, you're ready to go. And uh, that is pretty much it. Again, like I said, it is accessible from the lock screen. So I guess I could show you that real quick here. Go ahead and light it up and swipe it up so there you go there is control center uh and that's gonna be it for this video guys i hope you guys did enjoy it if you did definitely throw me a thumbs up that helps me out tremendously also if you guys want to see more ios 7 coverage be sure to click that subscribe button this has been jeremy with everything iDevice and i will catch you guys in the next one later